Good evening, everybody. I'm preparing this for you for your week of action for adult safeguarding. Um, my name's Alice and I'm the Corporate Director for Adult Social Care in Trafford and I'm a member of our uh, Safeguarding Partnership Board. Um, I'm really, really pleased that you're able to spend some time um, over the next week to really focus on some of the types of safeguarding and the issues that it creates for people when, when something happens in their life that they can't control and that shouldn't be happening. It's important as practitioners, you have time to refresh your thinking and to make sure that you're, that you're aware of all of the issues, be vigilant and, and look for the things that create the problems for people uh, that they face as, as adults. Um, and as adults, I mean, from, from being 14, 15, really, right into adulthood and to, into later life, there is not a time in anyone's life where things are not are, are not important to them, and um, and that starts with just how people are treated, how people are respected, how people are supported, and um, how people are made to feel valued, um, right through to very serious incidents that need to have the police supporting us to get people um, back to feeling safe. As the DAS for Trafford and the Director of Social Care, it's really important for me to know that each one of you feels confident to carry out your duties. Your duties to protect, your duties to support um, people's fundamental rights to feel safe at all times. Um, and I hope you see this in the day-to-day -day work that you do. Um, through through all the roles that we of, of people that we work with, it doesn't matter whether you are supporting strategic development or supporting somebody to cross the road safely. If you see, hear, or have anything reported to you at any time, it's you have a duty of care as an individual um, to your fellow a uh, man and woman uh, that you're working with. So the week of action is based on Ancraft's Trust Safeguarding Adults Week. It starts on Monday um, and it's going to be um, full of really interesting topics for you to think through and participate in. Um, it'll start with a Monday focusing on safeguarding and wellbeing, on Tuesday on how we safeguard, Wednesday understanding safeguarding legislation, Thursday, creating safer places, and Friday, institutional abuse, exploitation and grooming. These are really difficult and emotive subjects and, and, and situations that you all support every day um, uh, in your roles. But it's always important to keep up to date and refresh yourself. And this week is about taking time out to refresh your understanding and knowledge. And there will be interviews with local traffic professionals um, and we're trying our best to make this an interesting week and, and, um, and hopefully some times where you can reflect yourself but or you'll learn by listening to other people. Well, I'm going to end there. I just hope that you have a wonderful week of learning and excitement um, through the programme that we've set up and any feedback would be really welcome. Um, and Jed Pidd is our uh, Adult Safeguarding Board Manager and Emma Brown is our Principal Social Worker will be keen to get some feedback on how we could improve this further for next year. So have a great week and thank you very much everyone. Good evening.